Hi, my name is Princess. And my name is Precious. And you're watching Divine Duo. Duo. Guys, welcome back to our channel. It's been such a long time since we've done a relaxer update. Yeah, like a oh sit down together too. I know, yeah. Guys, new apartment, new vibes, new energy. Bang! Oh. Period. So well, yeah, if you're interested in knowing what's up with our relaxer update, stay tuned. Okay guys, let's start off by saying that our relaxer went well, I think both of us, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, my touch up, everything, relaxer day went smoothly. But before we talk about relaxer day, let's talk a little bit how, about how the stretch went. Mm -hmm. So and even before that, I just wanna remind everybody that like, we, this year, we decided to start stretching our relaxer to four months. So we are no longer, um, doing three, every three months. We're instead relaxing our hair every four months. So it is a bit different for us this year than it has been in the past, but um, we're managing. Okay guys, so with that four month stretch, how did it go, you may be thinking. Um, it went pretty well. I feel like it took so long for a relaxer day to come because we had so much yeah. going on in between. Mm -hmm. So I had a lot of I had done a whole bunch of hairstyles because we traveled, we did a whole bunch of different things. So I did, you know, fox locks, I did box braids, I did, um, I barely had my hair out. And in between those hairstyles, I really didn't have time to really even attend to my hair at all. Could have been a good thing, you know what I mean? Yeah. But I didn't have time to attend to it. And uh, I missed my hair, I missed her so much. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it looks lovely. As you can see, <laughs> yes, the movement's still here, y'all. And I did another trim. <laughs> So yeah, so I feel like this relaxer stretch for me, same thing. We traveled, like she said, and we've just been like doing a lot. So we've really been keeping our hair away. If you guys remember the last relaxer update video, our hair was looking lovely. We had cut it, we cut a good bulk off. We was Bob Mommies. Yes. And um, it was looking real good on the camera and it was a great relaxer update. Since then, I feel like I've just been protecting my hair. I really haven't been having it out. I don't really have any plans to have it out because that's what we said we're gonna do. We said we're gonna cover up our hair and we're gonna make sure that all the ends are tucked away, make sure that we're not bothering it because yeah. who likes to be bothered? Mm -hmm. No unnecessary breakage here, we don't need it. Okay. Nah, no thank you. And we're also in the journey of trying to care less about length, as you guys know, and more so about getting the health there. Like we want it to be 100% healthy before we start worrying about length. Mm -hmm. So, um, this update is not necessarily, we're not having a goal towards any type of length or anything. We're just going for the look. Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah, the, 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 the look, the health, and the volume. Like, seriously, we yeah. need not want to naturally have, like, let me not say volume, but like thickness to our hair because, you know, we do have some type of like thinness to our hair. We have fine strength. Fine, what we have. But we have a whole bunch of follicles though. So mm -hmm. that's why people be like, oh my God, your hair is so thick. It's really not. It's, not. <laughs> yeah, it's really not. But um, yeah, she did a good job of making it look like it was. And sorry, <laughs> sorry I don't have my hair out right now. Um, Precious just relaxed her hair last night. I relaxed my hair about like four days ago or yeah. like five days ago. So, um, you know, I've had my hair relaxed for quite some time now. So I decided to just do a bun. Okay guys, so um, with that being said, let's talk about Relaxer Day. That was such a twin thing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Relaxer Day, you wanna talk about yours first since you're talking first? Um, Relaxer Day was cool for me. I went ahead and did my 15 minutes on a timer. I did my five sections, one, two, and then three in the back. Precious helped me with the back while I did the front and went very smoothly. Um, I realized once again, not sure if it's just because I straightened my hair like very finely, but I feel like, I don't know, I don't feel like there was a lot of texture. Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll feel the texture more when I wash my hair again. But um, I only did it for 15 minutes, so I'm pretty sure that I didn't over process my hair. I don't know, maybe yeah, it's just okay. because I straightened my hair very, very well this time. I did very small pieces this time and I usually don't. But um, yeah, washed out my hair. Everything went perfect. No burning. I don't think I've ever had burning since like I'm used to do it. And that's why that goes to show. If your mom used to burn your scalp, good job. <laughs> you know why you used, we used to have like those scabs? Like literally, your hair was stuck to your scalp. Yes. Ooh. When you're done, like when you probably take down the wrap in the morning or something like that, and you had like a scab in one area. Where you, <gasps> those oh. are the days when, when mommy used to be like, oh. Um, 
Wait until it finishes cooking. It's not done cooking. Yeah, and you, you know, it's, know it's, and you know it's cooking when it's burning. That's not true. Yeah, she <laughs> used to like just wait until we used to be like, oh, it's itching right here, or it's burning over here. But yeah, yo, that was just like down memory lane just now. <laughs> so yeah, um, wash it out. I blew out my hair um, in big sections, and I went ahead and um, I flat ironed my hair. And I put my hair in sections and then I trimmed my hair um, at different, like, you know, lengths. But um, I went ahead and did a shake take. So here's my shake take. After this video, though, I plan on cutting it. I'm not gonna lie. I'm I told you. I am gonna cut it again because, like I said, we're not worried about length. Mm -hmm. We are worried about the, the more so the, the health oh. of it. And I feel like the ends, I'm not feeling that. Like, I want China bump. I want mm -hmm. it to be straight. I want it to be like, I don't want the thin ends, not not for me, you know? <laughs> and um, I'm gonna cut it again, period. <laughs> and I stand behind her when it comes mm -hmm. to that because as of right now, the scissor is our best friend. Yes. Really enjoying nice, blunt, even ends. And it's easier to take care of. And it's so crazy because now all of a sudden that we don't care about the late, the late when it comes. I'm looking at it, I'm like, okay. It grew a lot this stretch. It, it really did. did. But now, you know, we went back and of course I'm like, I'm cutting my hair every relaxing so I cut it again. Hello. And it was great. I mean I had a I had a field day in, in the bathroom with this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, talk, right. talk about your relax today. Yeah, so as you can see hers went well, mine went well. Oh wait, can I just talk about I'm so sorry. That's okay. Can I just talk about the fact that I do have this problem area right here? Should I talk about that now? Yeah. I have this problem area literally right here. We call it the cliff right here it is just wants to grow in this v type of thing and it's really bothering me and i was very hesitant about showing the picture but i might pop it in here if not ooh. um i mean she plans on cutting it off anyway yeah so. so i'll show another picture after that but it's just like that's been my problem area for years now and it's just if anyone out there knows how i can revive that how i can fix that problem please let me know because it's, it's really bothers me. I do not wear my hair down on my shoulders, no nothing. So I don't understand why. It must be the scalp in that area. I don't know. I've been trying to figure it out for a long time. And um, I need to give that, that area some TLC. But I just need a better understanding about what's going on there. Yeah, yeah, I dealt with it too. So I know exactly what she's talking about. And I gave that area some real TLC. Mm -hmm. I didn't. Nope. I basically chopped it off back there and just. Yeah, that's what I'm going to have to do. Because it's just like, what's the point of having um, good length hair or good up hair everywhere else? And then in that area, it's just bad. It just doesn't make sense. Thanks. So that's what's going on with her right now with me. Relax with me. Went well. Used my good old chest for me. Mm -hmm. And relaxed my hair. I think the whole process was like 20 minutes exactly. And I think it went perfectly. Look at it. It did help me out with the back smoothing process. Washed it out. I knew. Right away. <laughs> I even started taking videos again on my hair when it was wet. And it was just giving me that full type of text lax look that I absolutely love. Mm -hmm. So, it reminded me how my hair used to look back in the day. When it was really, you know, popping. Not back in the day, a few years ago. <laughs> so this time around, I did not blow dry it. But I did flat iron it. And it, it came out good. And then after flat ironing it, I seen the link. I seen everything, you know, was looking really good. But I promised myself I would do my trim every single relaxer. Yeah. So I did trim and I took my time with it. I did it row by row and then afterwards I even did it by a 90 degree angle and cut it straight across. And then I even pulled it down the front and cut it straight across as well. And my hair is very even. It is very even, you know, it's just bumped, but it's even on both sides. And I just, you know, I really fell in love with my hair again because it's, it's been a while since I've seen it you know, look like this and, and feel like this. So I know I'm in the right direction. I know I'm in the right track. Yep. Oh yeah, and then to get this little, you know, voluminous type of thing, I just did pin curls. And I used yeah. to do pin curls and I, I just, I love pin curls, they're very easy. Yeah, looks good. Thank you, sis. Mm -hmm. <laughs> As do your edges. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, guys, that's how I relax her number, Lord knows, Jesus. Um, 
went. We cannot <laughs> complain it went well. Um, I will definitely be posting in pictures of my before and after, as will she. Yeah. And yeah, thank you guys in the hair community that's still rocking with us, even though like you know our hair, our channel isn't primarily about hair anymore. Yeah, we're venturing out. Yeah, we're still keeping up with our relaxer updates. Because what one thing is that we're always going to be on the hair journey, no matter what. Like mm -hmm. you know. So yeah, do we have any goals for the next relaxer? Like we said, no. We just want to keep the health alive, right? Yeah. We don't want to try to go for no length, no nothing like that. We just want to continue with our protective styling, especially because winter's coming up, and you know this is the hardest for us relaxed girls. Dry, dryness is serious. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna just try to do protective styling and keep up with our daily regimens. Mm -hmm. So with that being said, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you want to join the PMP party, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, y'all. Thanks for tuning in again, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.